Hey guys, it's Melvin7 here. Subscribe if you haven't already, like the video, and yeah, peace. I might as well fucking do that because what the hell is there to talk about? What the fuck was that? It is a shambles how that cunt is still in charge of this club. Attacking philosophy, that's what he boasted when he came to here. To, to this club. No goals in 11 first half games at Old Trafford. Only one win against Liverpool. Yeah, it's fantastic beating Liverpool. Of course it is. But when you follow that up with a 1 0 loss against Southampton against an injury prone striker who they've just bought for 4 million, who headed it in, who had the best chance of the fucking game, it's a joke. We had one shot on target, and that was Daily Blind, a CDM who's been playing centre back for how long? A year? And he had a shot from 30 yards out, and this is acceptable. Fuck off. We didn't deserve anything in that game. We really did not, alright? It was a fucking joke. It's just bullshit punt the ball up to fucking Fellaini. I thought he would be a plan B, so I was happy that he stayed at this club, alright? I thought it would be a plan B, but no, it's a plan A. Literally punt the ball up to whoever the fuck you want to, because no one can get it. There's no cohesion in this team. 3-5-2, why the fuck are you playing 3-5-2? I know we've got a lack of fullbacks, alright? But we played Darmian and Cameron Brothwick-Jackson, alright? He was brilliant. Brothwick Jackson, he's 18 and he's performing better than most of the cunts on the pitch. But anyway, you're playing two fullbacks, all right. So regardless of how many fucking injuries you have, why aren't you playing four at the back? We have how many wingers sitting on the fucking bench, man? Memphis, Yanazai, Mata, who isn't a winger but gets played as a winger. Pereira, yes, he's a cam. He can play as a winger. Why the fuck are we playing three centre mids and one winger, one default winger? We've got Lingard out playing as fucking wing back, not even a winger, and Martial, who, where the hell is he playing? Is he, is he some weird winger in a fucking system where there's one striker and one winger and two fullbacks? I called it 3-5-2, but what the fuck is it? It literally doesn't matter what we play. It's ridiculous. Dormian was playing centre-back. He's a fullback. I, what the fuck, man? It's so simple. It literally is simple. Why didn't we line up? with, alright, the defence, keep it the same, but play four at the back, so have Brothwick, Jackson, and Dormian on the fullback positions, have Blinden Smalling as a centre-back, David De Gea in goal, then have Schneidlin as a holding centre mid, if you want, play 4-1-2-1-2, one, two, one, two, alright, and then have fucking Yanazai and Memphis on the wings, and then have Herrera in the pocket, and Martial and Rooney up top, and then play down the wings, play, you know, Passing football where you pass and move, not pass and pass it fucking sideways back to David De Gea and punt the ball up with one of the centre backs. It just makes no sense. It really doesn't, alright? Lingard, he's 23. We're acting as though he's 18. He's just burst onto the scene. He's not, alright? He's not good enough to be playing every single game. I don't want to hate on a player, but it, it, you just can't. You can't justify selecting him and Fellaini above some of the players that we've got on the bench. It's just ludicrousy. It literally is. And seriously, he'll come up with some bullshit fucking post-match interview that I don't want to watch, but he'll, he'll make an excuse. He'll make some fucking excuse, and we've got to get used to this for another... See, like, until the end of the season. We're going to finish 10th at this rate. We really are. This league has been fucking ludicrous. Liverpool beat... Fucking Norwich in a four five sorry five four game and they they're not far behind us. It, it it's stupid. We were in contention for the title prior to this game. That's how retarded it is. We didn't we had like one get one win in ten games or whatever the fuck the stat is right. And we were in contention for the title. That's how fucking shit this league is. And now we're not because we've just lost against Southampton. Leicester trashed their opposition. Deli Ali scoring fucking wonder goals that you know just oh my god. That's better than every fucking first half performance at Old Trafford combined. That one goal from Deli Ali. And what did it give Spurs? Three points. So now they're competing for the title. And now the distance between fourth is five points. We aren't getting top four this year. The best chance of us getting in the Champions League next year is fucking winning Europa. And can we do that? Can we even score against Mitte Silicelin Land? Ah, you know what? I don't even care. Whoever the fuck they are, alright? They, they, they. Um, fucking beat Southampton, didn't they? And look who just beat us. So, you know, I'm not looking forward to 25th of February, that banging nil-nil that we're going to see. Or oh, one nil to... Oh, I can't pronounce their name. You know what I mean, but... Oh, oh my days, man. Oh, just... Just, oh, just Louis Van Hal, please retire. 
or I do the right thing because Ed Woodward's a fucking knob. He's not going to fucking value the club over his pride. As long as his pride's there, he's, he's getting these banging sponsorships in fucking India, China, and God knows where else, raking in the cash to suck off the Glazers. You know, just fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck's sake, man. This hierarchy at the club is fucking AIDS-ridden. It's, oh, it's fucking AIDS. It literally is. It is just fucking AIDS.